What's the situation at home? There's an issue with the infirmary. I know we wanted to make some improvements, but we're missing a few things. We can track it down, or find another way. But it'd be faster if you did a little scavenger hunt. Might be something in here I can use. All quiet here. I'm playing on the PC right now, Magic. Can't wait for Year One Survival Edition, though. I will be playing that on the Xbox. One. Nice. Looks like no zombies were close by. gonna carry this yes it is oh uh, well I don't know if the year one special edition is but I know state of decay is I don't think year one special edition is because I don't think can handle the uh, I don't think the 360 can handle 1080p. Check this out next. Roger that. Oh no. around here. 
wanted to claim dibs on some of the better gear. I don't think anybody mocked. Hold on, I'm coming. Zed's up ahead. <laughs> I'll run this home. We'll be ready. How's it going? I'm almost there. There you go. Don't say I never gave you nothing. Oh, how you feeling there, buddy? Oh, you know, stuff. I gotta finish this. Scratch that off the wish list. Is everybody rested up? Oh, yeah. He's rested up. How are you doing? Are you okay? Oh, nice. Oh, wait. Anderson is feeling better. Zombies in. Yeah, genius. Quit wasting ammo. Holy shit. He's an armored zombie. Good shooting, though. Provide suppressor. This weapon. Um, stash this weapon. Oh, look. All my bladed weapons are repaired. Oh, battle axe. It's so nice. Um, I'd say the cons are minor graphical clipping issues. I don't know how good they're going to be right now uh, with the Year One Survival Edition. Sometimes zombies will clip through walls and doors as if they didn't exist. Um, but they're not like game breaking, they're just inconvenient. Pros are combat. The zombie combat is very fluid once you get the hang of it. Um, the game mechanics like the scavenging is very rewarding, but it can also be pretty punishing, so it's not too easy. If you're getting the Year One Survival Edition, you're getting like the best experience possible. 
you'll be getting all the DLC that's been released. I don't know how it is on the 360 if you're thinking about getting it on the 360. But uh, with the 360, if you get all of it, you're getting three separate game modes. One is a story mode on this level, which is a massive map by the way. Uh, the second one, what I'm currently playing, is called Breakdown, which is kind of an open-ended, no story. You're just trying to survive and keep pushing through like different challenges. Uh, let's see, these are some of the challenges. Right now I'm at level two. Uh, you can go all the way up to level six. Seems like we missed an opportunity. Each challenge there. you complete unlocks different characters that you can play as, and different characters that join your community. Uh, and I think each time you break down your RV when you're trying to escape, you uh, the game gets harder and harder. And you kind of like have to start over from scratch every time. It's not bad. It's definitely very difficult. Um, no other game has this kind of zombie mechanic, I feel. All the other games out there with zombies, especially the ones that are multiplayer, uh, they're less about survival and more about like fighting players. It's this game has rogue elements. If your character dies, he's dead for good. So if you are not careful, all that hard work you're putting into your character and leveling I'll up run your this character, Roger that. it could we'll be, be taken away really quickly. Uh, the cons, another con is that it's not multiplayer. That's a pretty down, pretty big downer. Sometimes, if you are suffering in this game, it can be difficult to come back. The first time I ever played, I failed at the church, which is like the first settlement you're given. I failed pretty hard. I had no idea what, what to do with outposts. I had no idea how the combat worked, how to do my finishing moves. I think over time they've improved it a lot. They've made the tutorial meshes, messages a little more uh, verbose so you know exactly what to do. And the game mechanics, once you get the hang of them again, they, they're more fun than a hassle. I've located a zombie infestation. Uh oh. Picking the right outposts, you can really mess up your colony. Food is important. The bigger your colony, the more food you're going to eat. 